so many different iterations of the definition of gentrification, but for the most part, what it is is the influx of capital or money and higher income, more educated residents into a working class community. Uh, it usually happens over years, or decades, or sometimes generations. Really nice way of saying people are getting evicted. Koreatown is a neighborhood in central Los Angeles. Historically, it has been home to Korean immigrants and their families, with many other racial and ethnic minorities that make up a large proportion of the population as well. However, over the past several decades, Koreatown has been changing. The neighborhood used to be filled with family-owned businesses, small shops, and rent-controlled housing. Now, due to the high housing prices in LA, many developers have come to the area in order to purchase the relatively cheap land to build luxury apartments and shopping centers. These developments fill Wilshire Boulevard and Vermont Avenue, but are also moving into areas zoned for residential use, with permission from the City Council and Mayor Garcetti's office. There is a blurry line between gentrification, which generally has a negative connotation, and development, which has a positive one. But to build these luxury developments, landlords selling their property evict leases or hike up rent prices to clear the area for developers. Furthermore, as a result of these new developments, property value in the area goes up, and the landlords subsequently increase rent. Many of the immigrant residents are low income and eventually get priced out of their area. And due to the lack of affordable housing in Los Angeles, many of these residents either end up on the streets or so far out of LA proper that accessing their jobs from their new homes in the Imperial Valley, North Valley, and South LA becomes extremely difficult.